Hi guys. I'm looking very tired, I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm also having slight issues with my skin at the moment. I think it's the backlash of the last few months of working constantly and not sleeping properly and being very stressed. I've just got a lot of texture going on in a few places and this morning I almost, it almost looked like I had lots of mini blood blisters under my skin here. So I'm not too sure what's going on really with my skin at the moment. I have however come back to a number of wonderful parcels. Where one of which is that um, I've decided to change all of our crockery in the house. Um, and in honesty, the only reason I've done it is because I saw there was a Soho home sale. And this sale, honestly, if you've not checked it out already and you're looking for new crockery and you want more countryside vibe crockery, you need to have a look because I've literally bought my entire new crockery set for £150 for an entire new set. Eight bowls, eight plates, eight side plates, a sugar bowl, a salad bowl, and four smaller like um, cereal bowls. I only really need four of those. And so I thought I'd quickly unwrap them. Loads of new dog food, always. Lots of Lilith's kitchen for our little bow. Let me show you as well what I just came home to. Just unwrapped this, completely unexpected, an unbelievable gift from the Louis Vuitton team. They've sent me a piece from their second collection drop with Yayoi Kazama. I mean, I've seen this bag all over social media. It has these really cute little gourds all over the bottom of the bag. I feel like this is such a perfect like, autumnal bag. I particularly love the blue side of this. It's super fun. I feel like that's what Louis Vuitton go for when they create these really fantastic, like one of a kind pieces. The inside is completely um, patterned and purple. But I'm just honoured, I'm really honoured that the Louis Vuitton team has selected me to send a piece to. I really am just so thrilled. Cannot, <laughs> cannot believe it. I'm going to unbox a few other bits that are here. Narciso Rodriguez, they've sent me a couple of top-ups of my favourite duo. The Narciso Rodriguez Pure Musk and Musk Noir Eau de Parfums. They come in these little duos, so you get two you get a little tiny one of each and they're like layering perfumes and they know how obsessed I am. I keep these in my handbag most days that I go out because they're so small and I love having them to layer. So they've sent me a couple of those, which is just incredibly wonderful. So here we go. Here are our new, new bowls, like either soup bowls, they could even be used for dips or for when people come around putting things in these. Gosh, sorry, I look so tired, wow. Yeah, but mainly we'll use these for uh, cereal, granola or whatever in the morning, but they're just so, so super lovely. Perfect. This is the starter plate. They do have a dinner plate, which is bigger by a couple of centimeters. However, we've had some really big plates now for a while, for a long while. We've had these dinner plates, which are the Rick Stein dinner plates. Um, and so these, are just a little smaller. We always found these plates too big and a bit over facing when you're wanting a slightly smaller meal. They're just massive. Yeah, I wanted to go a bit smaller. The dinner plates, however, I think are this size. They're like a 25.5, just so you know. <laughs> just to give you the details. Oh, they're so nice. The low bowls. These are the low bowls. They also have rimmed bowls. The rimmed bowls come over the side and have that kind of soup bowl lip. But I just like the, the idea of these. These are the low bowls and they are so great. Just a slight kind of ribbing around the edge. Just really classic, just classic pieces. Okay, then these are the bread plates. So they have starter plates, they have dinner plates, then the starter plate then a side plate, and then a bread plate. The bread plates are smaller to them all, I think it's like 15 centimeters, but it's just a perfect little tiny plate. So what you need is a little side plate. Yes, yeah, so these come in like boxes of four. And I think for like most of these things, I'm pretty sure for a box of four of these was like 15 pounds. So eight side plates. I think I have three things left here. And that is it. Let's see. So cute! Okay, that's adorable. Sugar bowl. That is magnificent. 
I thought to match, I'd also, seeing as it was available, buy the enormous salad. I think it's called the salad bowl. It's just an enormous bowl to match everything for obviously parties and guests. And if I ever make anything this enormous, this would be great. I mean, that's absolutely stunning. And it matches. So all of that, 155 pounds, I think. I can't even imagine how much I've saved actually because this was on sale. All I'm saying is run, don't walk to this guys because um, it's pretty awesome. Like I say, I think I might rebuy this entire set again for a second time for the new apartment in Manchester because this is just great. I think it's gonna be perfect. Okay, now I have something to show you that I want your opinions on. I've been eyeing up this jacket now guys for so long. In fact, ever since the runaway. Um, and I've been desperate for this jacket. So I went on to the actual store and found it. <laughs> so this, this has been an elusive character in my life, this leather jacket. I've been waiting and waiting and waiting for this to come online. But actually, I just found it on the Saint Laurent website. I've got it in the 34. That's what I've been waiting for. This, this is the smallest size to do, so that's what, what I've been waiting for. Bear in mind guys, I'm not looking my best right now, I'm looking a bit dishevelled and a bit tired, but hopefully you see the vision. Of course it's meant to be oversized, the YSL vibe right now is oversized, okay? I want you to get the full vision here as I intend it to be. So this is the kind of famous Saint Laurent leather jacket that, I don't know, it depends if you look at the same things I do, but this is everywhere for what, for what I look at. It was on the runway and I absolutely swooned over it as soon as I saw it. And so I really, really wanted it. What I really like about it the most, actually, is the fact it's so lightweight. It's really lightweight. So I'll be able to wear this through spring and summer because it's really not heavy. But I mean, it's like butter. Like, it's the softest, smooth, smoothest, most beautiful leather. Um, and then on the inside, you can button up here to pull it in. So you could wear it oversized and open and just chilled and chic. But what I love about it is that it has its belt section here. So if you want it to be that really fitted silhouette around the waist and then oversized on top, you can do that and pull it in. It's so flipping chic, isn't it? This is very much the Saint Laurent vibe at the moment. I'm so obsessed with big shoulders. That's the point of this. It's meant to just be cool and structured to the heavens, pretty much. It's meant to give you the most powerful shoulders you've ever seen. But it's fashion, darling, that's why. <laughs> what do you think? What do you think? Try and, try and see this in the kind of fashionable sense of the word and not as the super duper everyday leather jacket is what I'm saying. This is one of those pieces I'll keep forever because it's iconic. I'll probably wear it a lot like this actually, just over full black chic outfits, roll necks, black boots, and then this just thrown kind of casually over top is that extra piece <sighs> let me know your thoughts <laughs> so right, i've literally just put on a slightly darker lip balm this is one of the, like the dior balms so good i'd rather wear this in a lipstick okay i've just texted the gals and i've just texted suze to ask for opinions i think so far everyone is obsessed with the jacket so i think it's going to be a keeper but let me know what you guys think now then, three more parcels. I thought, let's see what else we've got whilst we're here. Oh, these are so great. Okay, so there's a really beautiful brand that I have just found out about. It's called Atana. They make beautiful shoes. I'm currently in the planning for a trip away to the sunshine. And so I've been after some new, just like, I'll be honest, for this next trip that I'm going on, I don't want everything to be just all sort of like new, 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 new stuff. I wanna take loads of, loads of bits that I already have, which is why I was clearing out my bikini collection in the last video. And I've got it down to my absolute favorite bikinis that I'm obsessed with still, after like five years. And I'm just actually really eager to take them away with me on holiday again and, and treat them good. However, Atana got in touch and asked if I'd like a pair of shoes and it was just like perfect timing. I think this particular pair is kind of like their hero product of the season. I get the feeling that I've seen them in all of their campaigns. They are really cool. So unique. Look at that heel. This shape. Just imagine them in like Ibiza or a night out. 
anywhere that's a bit more hot and sunny and you want to wear just like a really gorgeous mule shape like this that's comfortable but you want it to be like fancy that is so cool absolutely love those with a gorgeous little black dress and just these bare legs little tiny black dress and these gorgeous i love the dust bags that's so nice super th oh it's one it's one big dust bag for both it's really thick oh my gosh just realized it's a double dust bag okay this is amazing the amount of times i've wondered why brands don't do this and put a a stitch through the middle because i'm forever using a dust bag for my heels and then i always think well they're going to clink together and they're going to scratch each other this is brilliant this is like one this side and then you put one in the other side love those thank you so much to atana for sending me this dreamy pair of shoes i'm so excited to wear these honestly they're perfect for this trip see look at that that's what they're both sat in this little bag and they're safe oh i love it when things work out properly talking of shoes guys i um i put an instagram up a few days ago with a pair of saint laurent heels so i should do two pairs of shoes but at the moment you know how obsessed i am with ysl and i went for it and actually the reason i went for it is because i had a little bit of credit on my netaporte account and so i thought why not why not get these shoes once i have the credit once again beautiful saint laurent you know what's coming if you follow my instagram you'll know what's coming here they are <laughs> so i have these in black as you may have seen are they patent though yeah i have them in black patent i just realized these aren't patent these are more of a matte cream so actually it's quite nice that they're different and by the way i in the last ones that i bought i sized up a half size so i've done the same again so actually instead of getting a 37 as i usually would these were 37 and a half so in fact let me just try these and just double check but yeah 37 and a half they're perfect that incredible square square section over the toes the unbelievable point on these the stunning stiletto strap these aren't great and again they fit they fit really really great should i keep them yeah gosh i feel so lucky right now this is ridiculous new shoes two new pairs of shoes an incredible leather jacket a beautiful louis vuitton bag honestly i don't understand what i've done to deserve all of this this feels very zoomed in zoomed in that's why as you guys know though that watch me a lot how you know how grateful i am for these moments but equally equally i bought the leather jacket myself and i bought i bought these myself but still okay one last um one last thing that i actually don't know i don't know what this is oh i know what this is i know what this is bless her one of my favorite prs in the industry lauren at max mara she has she sent me this coat to take on the Dior beauty trip with me and it unfortunately arrived like two days into the trip it just didn't quite get here on time but she sent me the baby blue teddy coat oh it's so fabulous i actually don't own a max mara teddy coat i think probably because it does not quite as me like i'm into i mean you know how much i adore max mara and the camel coats and the soft smooth wool coats are much more me um, but this is so fun and so sweet and it really would have been so fab on the on the trip because it was so cold in scotland and it would have been so nice to take pictures in this right gosh okay just looking out at the garden every day is different now in the garden which is so exciting as soon as it gets to spring things start to blossom the clematis I've got beautiful white flowers in the clematis now. I've got more daffodils happening. Hydrangeas have got some leaves on them. Oh, I think the trees are starting to get some leaves. Who knows? Who knows? <laughs> right, okay. Next thing is next. I absolutely need to take off all of this makeup. I need to take off all the makeup. And I'm going to go under... My new favourite toy, I've actually had it for a little while, but because my skin has been a little bit sensitive recently, I got it back out again and I've been using it consistently, like three times a week. Oh, sorry, this contains a little paid for advertorial. It's a current body flex. It's a machine that emits red light or blue light or infrared light. 
onto your skin. So I thought I'm gonna go take off my makeup and I'm gonna go onto the red light for a little bit because I, um, I do really need it. I don't know what's going on with my skin, but it's just looking really, really sad and unhappy. <laughs> So let me quickly show you what I've been using. This is the Current Body Dermalux Flex. It's a professional at home LED treatment machine. But secondly, they have this one. You may have seen this a little bit more. I feel like I see a lot of people talking about this on their Instagram, on Reels and things like that. The thing that's quite great about this product is that it's a little bit less time. You can get your treatment done in 10 minutes with this. And you can also wear it while you're moving around the house. So if you're someone that finds you find it difficult to sit still or maybe you don't have the time to lay down for 30 minutes because not everybody does and in honesty I, you know, putting that 30 minutes aside three times a week, I'm really trying to train myself to do it because you obviously can't look at anything. Underneath this you can't, you have to wear goggles the whole time, obviously to protect your eyes from the LED. But with the LED face mask you can have your eyes showing like this, so your eyes are not covered. However, if you do have sensitive eyes, it does come with goggles as well, if you prefer. But that's why this one has become so viral recently, I think, because a lot of people wear them while they're cooking, or obviously use it safely, but while they're doing other things. Hey, darling. I've been using the Dermalux Flex. What's so great about this product is obviously it's a professional at home LED treatment machine. This is gonna set you back a lot more than the LED mask. So in terms of price points, these are both very, very different. However, I do have some discount codes to give you. I have Victoria that gets you £45 off of this, which is incredible. I'll leave all of the information down below. I'll also leave it on the screen in case I do say anything incorrect. It is 10.30 at night. It's 10.30 at night right now. I'm just about to go underneath the light, so I didn't want to miss telling you about it. And I have £200 off of the Dermalux Flex. So if you have been thinking about buying this for yourself, it's kind of the perfect time. Again, I'll leave all the information down below. Just to give you a bit more information on what this is, why it works. So this particular product uses red light therapy. Red light has been found to increase the speed of which wounds heal, for one. So if you have any blemishes, if you have any scarring, it's also really great for acne treatment as well. It helps to increase the circulation of the skin and therefore increase the speed of which you're able to start to heal any wounds on your face. So the reason I started using LED light a few years ago, probably about five years ago now, because at the time I had a number of blemishes that just were not healing and so I went to see a dermatologist and they said we need to try some red light treatments for you and having those treatments enormously helps so I know that red light therapy for me works really really well but one of the biggest selling points for these products is the fact that they do therefore increase your circulation and help to produce more collagen in the skin as we're getting older collagen production is a lot lot lower and in honesty if products like this help me to encourage my skin to keep producing more collagen or to at least give it that little bit of a boost then I'll do what I can and it's the reason why products with LED lights have become so so popular let me quickly show you so you put this on this attach it around try not to scare your dog in the process sorry Bo <laughs> and then you literally just turn it on and that's it. And it takes 10 minutes. After 10 minutes, the light will completely cut out. That is just that just means that your 10 minute treatment is up. But the fact is I could now put this in a pocket and I can wander around, I can do other things. Oh, my husband. What the hell? <laughs> have you brought me a water? Uh -huh. Thank you. I'm just do my treatment and then we can watch a film or something in bed. Bye bye. <laughs> bye. So for any of you guys who are a bit more time poor, need to be on the move and whatnot, then this is great. So I wanted to double check. My discount code for this is Victoria and you get £45 off this LED mask. So therefore you'll get the mask for £234. And it also says here on the website, 35% reduction in wrinkles in just four weeks. The product that you're currently sat on is the Dermalux Flex. This is for any of you guys who do already undergo a lot of LED treatments. You're going a number of times in a month, maybe. A treatment like this can be, say, 40, 50 pounds. It depends where you live. So if you're someone who goes a lot, buying your own at home could be a great way to sort of save. I must admit as well, it is rather wonderful having this here at the house. I feel like I'm literally having my own beauty treatment when I put this on. Like I said, Victoria 200 will get you 200 pounds off the 
machine, so that's a really fantastic saving. But the reason the price point of this is higher is due to the fact this is a medical grade machine, this is used by a lot of professionals around the world. And what's also so great about it is the fact that because this is a hood, this comes out of here and then you can lay it flat. Which means that you can also utilise this product to help with joint pain, muscle pain, psoriasis, aching muscles. You just press the red button. Also, I've been liking to add the infrared into this as well. So you can have red with infrared. The infrared light penetrates a little deeper as well than the red light. So together you can use those together. And then you literally press it on. And then you just put on your goggles. And then relax. And then you set this off and it goes for 30 minutes. Of course, you can turn it off in between if you want to just do 20 minutes, but you can completely cater this to exactly what sort of LED treatment that you want. I'm a huge fan. I just wanted to let you know that I've been utilising this a lot. The discount codes are down below if you do want to treat yourself. Just for a quick 10 minute treatment, now that Alex is literally on his way up, I'm going to carry on with my treatment of this and then get to bed. But after this, you will see the rest of the video. <laughs> you will see the rest of the vlog is all dedicated to the beautiful Dior Beauty trip. So I hope you enjoy it. Hey guys, we've just arrived in Edinburgh. We're staying at the Balmoral Hotel. We're here on a Christian Dior beauty trip. Do you know, I feel very like honored that we still work with Dior beauty. I mean, how many years do you reckon it's been that we've been seven, invited maybe? on these beautiful trips? Probably like, Six, seven years, yeah. Do you remember when I got my first ever Dior Beauty parcel and it came in this like silver packaged box and it pushed together with almost like perspex, like perspex wrap in the middle and it kind of like encapsulated these lipsticks. It was almost like they were like vacuumed into it, do you remember? And it opened and then they like, and all these lipsticks were laid out and I was like absolutely gobsmacked and was like, I can't believe that Dior Beauty have sent me PR parcel. Do you remember we're in our first flat in London? It was such a moment. It just feel, it feels amazing to still be invited on these trips. And this is gonna be a really, really good trip. We are going tomorrow on a train, the Royal Scotsman train around the east coast of Scotland. We're stopping places on the way. I mean, I don't really give too much away, but it's gonna be really magical and we're with a really great group of people. And again, the reason I think I'm feeling so honored that we're still here is because there's so many cool people on this trip, like a lot younger and in different niches. Some are TikTok and some are models. And I feel like it's kind of like an OG on these trips, almost like the oldie of the group. But yeah, I think this is gonna be a really, really great vlog. <laughs> Oh my god, you scared me. I was like, trying why? to get a nice shot of you in the mirror. <laughs> I was like, why is the door opening? I didn't understand. I'm getting ready. I'm all set up, trying to do like a little Dior, like get ready with me for the morning. You've been down for coffees, was it good coffee? It's pretty good. Was it? Mm -hmm. oh, I'm excited, the food's on route, it should be here so shortly. Oh, I'm really excited. So let me, I just need to get something from over here. Let me show you these new products. Get out of the way! <laughs> Yes, yeah, so we got here last night and the Dior team had left. Ooh! We've got the bag tags. How sweet is this? Dior bag tags. We need to put these on our bags. And then we're in car and cabin 1F. Mm hmm. And um, we have tickets. And then it's got lots of really great products. And in fact, you got some products too. The team gave Alex like a little bit of concealer and some Dior powder and the iconic lip balm, which is so sweet. For me, they gave me. Red lip liner, Game of the Dior Glow. Is that the breakfast? I've also got Pump and Volume Mascara, which is one of the best, <laughs> one of the best mascaras ever. I've not had this for a while, so this is exciting and easy today. In fact, I was on like the launch in LA for this when they did this. Blush, this is what I'm after. The blush. So I'm gonna put this on. Continue getting ready because we don't have much time, husband. Gosh, what a fantastic day in Scotland. There's not a cloud in the sky. And we're literally right next door to the train station and heading straight down to the Royal Scotsman. I am so excited about this.
would like to wish all of you the warmest of welcomes on board. It's kind of going to go, so... How cool is this? And the treatments that are on the train in the Dior Spa cabin are really about helping circulation, helping travel. They're also about, what's really special about them, they are only on this train. So they're about engaging with the Highlands, they're using the Dior Prestige line. They're to do with helping you get in touch with nature, helping to de-stress, helping circulation. Welcome to our cabin. I always wondered what these would be like or how big they were. It's actually bigger than I expected. So we've got two little single beds. This is mine and Alex is here. Sweet little desk for me to do my makeup. In fact, we have gifts. This is like memorabilia about the train and then cute little white cosmetic bag with the Dior Prestige creams eye cream, serum and cream in there. I mean this is what they're going to be using during the Dior spa as well. So in a few hours actually we have our spa treatment. Here, delighted to welcome you aboard the Dior Spa Royal Scotsman. Whoa. Dior Vanity. Oh that's beautiful. Oh. Dior Hair Bobble. Oh that's, oh my gosh this is so cute. I might keep this in the guest bathroom. And then a Dior face mask so we can go to sleep later. Although these are really thick curtains, I'm sure we won't even need it, but that is so gorgeous. Next thing on the agenda, we've all just been having drinks in the observation cart. It all feels very snow piercer, don't you think? <laughs> and then yeah, at three o'clock we are going to have our spa treatments. I'm about to have my spa treatment. This is so amazing as Edinburgh, well, as Aberdeen and Scotland fly by. I'm going to be having a massage treatment with Dior body products, the Dior Prestige line. It's gorgeous in here. Have you seen all of the wallpaper with the 12 inch weave? Absolutely unreal. This is just idyllic, absolutely idyllic. I've had a quick change as well. I'm now in my, my Holland Cooper beige top and my beautiful black shorts. I don't think I've shown you these in a while. So exciting. I thought I'd change my spa treatment, because why not? <laughs> what a camera angle. I better hide my boobs. <laughs> this is so cool, babe. What a moment, what an experience. Victorians, <laughs> very important, listen out. We have reached the Kashmir factory and Victoria McGrath is completely in her element. If the Victorians, the new Victorians don't know already, she is Kashmir Queen. As well as being Queen of the Victorians, she is Kashmir Queen. I do love a Kashmir. I know you do. Well, you like a Kashmir too. I do, I love a Kashmir. Kashmir sweater. Yeah. Can't go wrong with it. Same. Well, I'm wearing Kashmir right now, babe. Exactly. Am this I now? This is my new Kashmir Holland Paper collection. Yeah. Ultimate. Yeah. Exclusive. <laughs> Exclusive. Exclusive to McGrath X Holland Cooper. <laughs> How cute, guys. Thanks, Ra Ra. Just, I'm just not worthy of her. Like, she's too much. <laughs> <laughs> so then it was passed on to Mr. Harrison. He had been working with the company as a designer for about 15 years down in London. It's missing pieces because designers used to take samples. So it's, they would cut a piece out and they would... They would Were they allowed to put the pieces out? So back then, yes. Oh. Now, um, they still come in here for inspiration, but it's all later digitalised. Oh, oh, I see. 
but you can still see some quite classic patterns. Wow. So what they would do is at the very beginning would be almost like a content page and it would say exactly the number of the customer, the detail of their, their name, and then they can go through and see what they are doing. Easier way of telling them. It's amazing, isn't it? <laughs> do you want one an I would love one of those. Oh, I can't look. Daffodils. She was just loving the big bush. Yeah. <laughs> Thick bush. Is what I call it. <laughs> so in you come guys. Oh wow, that's actually really like that's kind of eerie, like how soft it is. It's amazing. Wow. Francis is enjoying that. <laughs> wow. So every spring we comb the gold. It, it took me like a second to process that I was watching something on the floor. I know just that's crazy. That's actually we shear the the sheep, but we don't do anything else. We, yeah. We're very kind to them too. Yeah. <laughs> but it's not as soft, it is a wee bit mm, yeah. Yeah, that, that other one was unbelievable. Yeah. They only grow to about three to four feet tall and they're all natural caramel colours. So this woven piece, just for this wee piece, you'd be looking about hundred pounds. So um, but that is super soft, but we don't get any more to play <coughs> than that. The fibres will be pushed outside your seed brushes and it will come in here and in effect it's like a candy floss machine so it's just aerating the fibres to, to try and get some of the matting and pull the best out of the fibres. You, you, can, you can lead like without... I am, I am myself. <laughs> Obviously, not native to Scotland. However, what they think has happened is that they've had a big bag of maybe wool come over from China. Someone a long time ago has kind of scattered the end of the bag into the soil, and it's just happened to have a seed which is planted and rooted into that incredible Chinese pistachio tree. However, it won't turn into pistachios because it needs a female tree to pollinate it. So it needs two to pollinate. And there isn't a second one. So it will never make pistachios. Just one of the interesting things we're learning at Johnson's of Elgin. Or is it Elgin? No, it's Elgin. It is Elgin. Like I said earlier, when I was at Elgin, you were like, ha ha ha, it's Elgin. And I was like, I'm sure it's Johnson's of Elgin. You did. And actually this lady's been saying Elgin the whole time. That was, so, by the way, so interesting. I can't tell you what was in there, but they're making some pretty amazing brands over in that manufacturing area. Let's just say it's a very, very famous British brand. Back to the train. Okay, so we're going for dinner. You've not seen my suit yet. So I'm wearing my new Holland Cooper collection cream suit. <laughs> Ben, I've got your phone. Oh, thank you. Yes. Amazing. Okay, next place, I'll sit on the end. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Sauvignon Blanc. Oh, yeah, I see. The best. The best. I think we've had this. Oh, the non alcoholic. Yeah, absolutely. I'll get you one of those. Yes. Oh, you know my name? Yes, yeah. We learned everybody's name. Alex. Oh, like my husband. Yeah, exactly. That's maybe why I remember you were Victoria straight away because I saw your husband was Alex. Alex. You're welcome. Very excited. Would you like some Sauvignon Blanc? I was just trying to persuade everyone else to go to bed so that I didn't get FOMO for the fact that we want to go to bed. <laughs> like, you all want to go to bed now, please. Thank you. Don't have to tell me twice. Yeah. <laughs> but it's 20 to 1. I really want to go to bed. I don't want everyone else to carry on enjoying themselves. How dare they? FOMO killer. <laughs> yeah. 
Oh, thank you. Thanks, good night. Good night. Take care. Thanks, mate. Good Cheers. night. Oh. Good night. <laughs> Thanks, Alex. Good night, mate. Night, mate. Bye, Alex. Good, good night. night. Good night. <laughs> right, so off to bed. Good night. Good night. Good night. <laughs> good night. <laughs> right, God, it's so far to get back, isn't it? It's literally five miles this way. It's like being on Snowpiercer. Without seeing me. Don't know where you stay. <laughs> You're not going sentimental on me, are you? <laughs> You're so funny walking down. <laughs> where are we going? Which car? Which car are we going in? <laughs> oh, Victorians, let's go! You're not with us. Yeah, I might as well. <laughs> let's go. Oh, we're going to Lake Cottage. Oh, I can't deal with a plant change. Yeah. Oh, I can't deal with a plant change. Good morning guys, welcome to day two on the Dior trip. So this morning we had a really, really delicious breakfast that Rose put together for us. It's just super healthy, like avocados, salmon, there's lots of very like antioxidant foods. And now, this is a bit I've been really looking forward to, we're going on a walk through the Scottish countryside for like a moment to feel present and in the moment. And we're going to get to a beautiful lock and take off our shoes and stand in the water and feel the energy. <laughs> You're going to put your cold feet, your, your water into cold. I'm absolutely putting my feet in the cold water. Are you not? I think it'd be nice, it'd be grounding, feeling the energy of the Scottish water on your feet. It's going to be great. Quick, get presenting, Vic. What? Get presenting. I have, I was presenting a minute Yeah, what, what mountains Stunning. are these? I don't know. Stunning. Scottish mountains. Yeah, but it's not, this is your like show. But how tall are you? Oh no, you're on top of me. Go down there, that's better. <laughs> Why does everyone bully me? Why is it always me? Like, Why? I was silent, you were like devastated. <laughs> yeah. Okay, okay, okay. 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 Adventure girl. Adventure girl. We spent a little bit of time in touch with the earth. You can do it with your hands. It doesn't have to be your feet. You can do it. You can do it lying on the sand. You can do it swimming in the sea. But it helps to rebalance our negative, our, our electricity in our body. And then that in turn helps inflammation and is really good for pain. So anyone who has any aches and pains, earthing is really good, really good for it. And actually, those who have got their shoes off doing will it. tell us. It's not that cold. It's actually oh, she's really cold. Really one off. It's yeah. cold. <laughs> it's actually we know physiologically it's really important to get out of our sympathetic nervous system, our stress system, into our anti-stress system for lo you know for longevity, for overall health, just for anti-anxiety. Anxiety is on the rise and rise and rise. So just taking a moment to take a deep breath. So I want you to close your eyes. Just close your eyes, and we're going to do something called box breathing. Cold. Wasn't that, wasn't that nice and fresh? Yeah, that was amazing. <laughs> Honestly, it, just, it was nice to feel that like, groundedness, yeah. wasn't it? Right. I really enjoyed that. It was nice. that. It's just nice to do something that you don't normally do. Yeah, exactly. Like, when else are we in Scotland to put our feet in a lock? Never. Okay. Exactly. Got you have that opportunity. Seize the moment. <laughs> but you know, even in your house, you should, <laughs> like, when you yeah, yeah, flights and stuff like that. Sometimes. Just get your your shoes off and like walk around in the grass. Yeah, I know. I I, I have do been do thinking. About, I'm going to start doing it more. I do in um in summer 
every morning I go outside and walk around bare feet with my coffee and look at all the flowers. Oh, that's very nice. Which I like doing. Yeah. So, yeah, yeah I need to do it more though, more time of the year, I think. You know, I just think it's a minute for you to just disconnect. I know, I need to do that more. I, think. I don't want to be friends. friends. I don't want to be friends. I don't want to be friends. I don't want to be friends. <laughs> want you for romance? I want you loving. I want, want your revenge. revenge. You and me can write a bad romance. Oh, oh, oh. Well, I want your loving. All your love, love is revenge. revenge. You and me can write a bad romance. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> this is my James Gordon. Oh, <laughs> looks amazing. How exciting! Everyone looks so beautiful. We're on our way to Glen Eagles Hotel, um, so everyone's got themselves ready for this Dior Beauty, Dior Beauty Gala at Glen Eagles. <laughs> look at Kit! Look looking at, fab! You look She's looking fun. fab! <laughs> <laughs> approval! A Gen Z approval! A Gen Z approval, well, <laughs> I'm letting go, yeah, whatever. <laughs> I'm admiring your Loewe t-shirt. Thank you. Alex is quite the fashionista. He's got his own unique sense of style. Oh, finally, bread. <laughs> I'll just start it on the After two days of being gluten free. <laughs> I know. Um, gosh. So I thought no one would ever offer. Chasey, um, I would like I would I would like both of these, please. Yes, thank you. Yeah, you can have both. Because I have one. But you have mine, please. You have mine. Tonight, everybody, we are at Glen Eagles Hotel having a Dior Beauty Gala dinner. I'm with my homeboy Rara. Rara's looking gaunt tonight <laughs> after two days of dieting. We're on a wellness retreat. However, tonight Rara has some bread, so he's very excited about it. I'm so excited for bread. I thought yeah. I was literally on the verge of ordering a McDonald's as soon as I get back home. What's this? <laughs> the Victorians need to know. Um, it was either that or a Dishoon curry. Oh. Mm. Do you eat the shoe? Yeah, I do. Does oh, that look like the shoe? Have you ever had the breakfast shoe? Oh my god, I love the vegan naan bread with the Everything, egg. the quinoa pal, oh. the chicken ruby. Me and Alex have started making them at home for breakfast. Oh naan bread, eggs, fake bacon, a bit of cheese. Oh. What's fake bacon? What's the difference between. Is it like turkey bacon? What's it made of, that fake bacon? Probably like mushrooms. Yeah, probably like mushrooms. It's delicious. Okay, if you don't like bacon, you never know. You do know. I don't know. <laughs> anyway, so we're at the Dior, the Dior Beauty Gala dinner. Um, tell us about your look of the evening. I'm wearing Jean-Baptiste Savali Couture. Really having a moment, I guys. I real moment. <laughs> Jean-Baptiste Savali is finally doing menswear, so it's a really exciting moment. Yeah. Uh, what Dior cool. Beauty look have you got tonight? The Dior Beauty look that I have. So my staples for the sort of perfect no makeup makeup look, the brow gel. I love using the backstage concealer. Love it. A little bit on the under eyes. Mm -hmm. And then the universal lip balm. Yeah. You can't go wrong with that. And what I love about it is that it doesn't really leave that sort of dewy tint. Yeah. So for guys that, exactly. And I think that's perfect for guys that don't want a shiny lip while still hydrating. And then I did, I did a full, I did my own glam tonight. I love like? it. What's really funny is that I was speaking to Denise early and she was like, what hairstyle should I do? And this is literally the hairstyle I had interpreted to her. Really? And you've done it. Really? What, like crimped and then in a bottle? Literally, I was like, it's so nice. It's like understated cheap glam. Love it. Well, I filmed the whole look and then, and then my lipstick of the evening, just so we've got that on camera. Your lip, 5, 2, 1, nice, new, Ooh. I love how you've gone for a darker lip. Yeah, slightly darker new, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, it's really nice. 